Today, I'm just gonna stay home. Um, I actually have one lecture today. Um, so I didn't feel like going to campus for it. I can just watch it online later. Um, I've been, lately, yeah, this week, I've been um, kind of missing some lectures and just catching up on it later on my own because lectures are like two hours long and I find that those two hours, and if we have two lectures that day, those four hours, that can be very productive, you know, doing something else than just catching up on the lecture later. So yeah. Today, um, I plan to have a very productive study day. And then later tonight, I'm very excited because I am shadowing in the, the trauma center. So I'm gonna do a full night shift of shadowing. So that's from um, 11 p.m. to 7 a.m. or 8 a.m. the following morning. So yeah, pretty much it's through the emergency medicine interest group, which I'm the president of. And so this year we really made an initiative to get a shadowing system going with the emergency department. So yeah, typically when I shadow, like when I went in first year, I only went for maybe like four hours. So this is going to be different doing like a full shift and a night shift. So I'm going to make sure I take like a little nap later tonight before um, I go in. But yeah, so we also have um, exams, five exams coming up and then the semester will be over. It's crazy to think that first semester of second year is already coming to a close. And then like next semester will, will really be like my last semester of being like in a classroom consistently for school because you know your first two years in medical school you're in the classroom and after that you're doing um, third and fourth year you're doing clinical rotations in the hospital so yeah this is all really flying by and it's really exciting and then when um, when the semester is done um, after finals are done or after exams are done I'll be going to Nigeria for the Christmas break so this will be my last vlog up until the new year up until uh the new year then i'll be back with um videos after the new year when i resume classes and all that so yeah i'm really looking forward to um the holidays in nigeria this christmas so yeah let me get to work i made a to-do list for the entire week and it's now friday and i've been making it through um every every single thing on my list and i want to keep that up for today as well So let me see if I can show y'all outside. It has been snowing all day. It's about like um, 10 o'clock. It's about 10 o'clock now. Um, I finished studying around seven and then I went to sleep because I have to go in the hospital at 11. It's a night shift so I felt I should sleep for a few hours. 
but I don't know how the roads are gonna be. If it's too rough, then you know, I'll just of course turn around and um, not go in. But I was able to get to pretty much everything on my to-do list this week, which I am so happy about because usually that doesn't always happen. So I started from Sunday, made a to-do list all the way to today, which is Friday. And then you can see all those check marks. I've just been um, going through, going through. Um, sometimes I use a uh, white paper to do my to-do list, but this is the actual planner that I use. This one, gonna have to get a new one soon. But yeah, I also went ahead and made a schedule for this, uh, for Saturday and Sunday, since I'm gonna come home tomorrow morning, sleep, and I wake up, I just wanna have, you know, my to-do list already made, and I have to plan anything out. So yeah, I think I'm just gonna eat something, get dressed, and then head to the hospital. All right, so I'm all set. I just want to quickly show y'all what's in my white coat. Have my um, stethoscope, and then let's see. Um, it's like a little notepad to um, write little things. I got this from school, some event they had. And then this is a white coat clipboard. It has like different lab values and like EKG, stuff like that, that you can put paper in it. I actually don't think I'm gonna bring this. I was thinking about um, bringing some lecture notes, like just in case I had some downtime, but one of my classmates uh, went to the, she shadowed in the trauma center earlier this week and she was like, it was very packed and busy. So I don't think I'm gonna have time to look at any notes. So I'm actually gonna leave this. And then, um, like a little Nutri-Grain bar, uh, in case I get hungry. I have two, actually. So, yeah, I'm all set and ready to go. I really hope the roads are clear. Grab my jacket. Ooh. Alrighty. Okay, camera battery's about to die, so I'll talk really fast. But it's about six o'clock, left about an hour early. It was a pretty good night though. Um, wasn't super busy. Um, I got to do um, suturing on a head laceration, so that was pretty cool, first time suturing. But yeah, overall it was a good night in the trauma center. About to head home now and get some sleep. So like I mentioned earlier, this will be my last vlog until the new year. And I'm out of breath because I ran because it is battery died. But I was saying I'm out of breath because it is still snowing and it's freezing. So I ran in here. Okay, I'm going to try this one more time. Now on my phone, my battery died. Um, yeah, so I hope you all have a great holiday and a happy new year. I'll see you all in the, news, in the new year. Um, make sure you subscribe so you'll keep up uh, with when I come back with the new vlogs. And give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Bye guys. Cold. Going home to sleep. <laughs>